find out you were the guy this week and how much work did you mm -hmm. put in to get yourself ready for today? Um, yeah, I found out uh, Sunday. And you just treat it like, like, like each and every week, you know, just day by day is our motto. So prepared that way and just kept my head down and worked. What did you see on the on the last play there? It looked like Levi, Scott's and Levi sort of had an option brought on what he was doing. Um, yeah, we just had a miscommunication there. Can't can't have that happen. Did you feel the things change on the sideline after the block on Um I mean, no, a little bit. Just we can't let that happen. You know, we gotta we gotta bring our own energy. Um, so we can't let that happen. We just gotta bounce back. Yeah, on the, the couple times the ball hit the turf, um, what sort of did you see happen? I know you, you gotta make quick decisions there, but what, what happened from your vantage point on those ones? Um, I mean, you know, that's part of the game. It's gonna happen. We just gotta endure it. What worked early in the game? I mean, you had two long touchdown drives in the first mm -hmm. half, and another obviously. Um, yeah, we we had a lot of energy then. We were we were driving. We felt good. We just got to keep that going throughout the whole game. Can't let up. Did it go? I mean, did it feel? Did you have any expectation for what it would be like to start the game? And, and um, you know, this is what I've dreamed of my whole life. You know, I mean, what more can you ask for playing here at home against Iowa? Even the way the game ended, I have to think you're probably thirsty for for more of that. Um, now you sort of enter the off season. What do you think? I know the game just ended, but as you think about what you just experienced, where do you feel like you're doing pretty well, and where do you want to immediately try to start working on getting better? I mean, yeah, there's you know take the good and bad from this game and work on those things and just move forward and get better each and every day. Are you the kind of guy that'll that'll watch this game a hundred times, or are you just gonna <laughs> file it away? Um, I'll probably watch a little bit and then I'll try to try to move on. A couple more for Logan. How much does this experience do you think help you through the next nine months? Yeah. Well, more, I'm a ton. You know, that's all I can ask for. Just being having the chance to play. You were just a part of the team that that, did, that lost eight, eight games by one score. No, no, no team in college football history has ever done that. Yep. In that locker room, as you guys move forward, what is what does that that fact mean? You know, how, how do you think that that plays over the month, over the weeks? Yeah, I mean, it just shows that how close we are. You know, we're we're right there. We just got to get over the hump. What should you hear from Adrian this week? Yeah, a ton. You know, he's always he's a mayor all week, so love that. You know, he's a great role role model to look up to, so really appreciate him.